as patron of the association in Northern Ireland, I'm always just hugely proud and just inspired to be here. When you see what people are doing with their lives through the most extraordinary handicaps, most extraordinary setbacks, and how they just get up every day and get on with their lives with a smile on their faces, it's absolutely inspiring. And I just look forward to meeting them all as often as I can, but especially at this gala evening. Our purpose here tonight is to recognize some of those affected by our working with stroke. The award recipients are represented of all those affected by stroke. And in closing, I'd like to recognize not only those who are receiving awards, but to all those who have been affected by the stroke, their families, and those who care for them. Well, I suppose it's a little thank you for all the years that I have worked in the stroke group in Bangor, the aphasia group, um, which I have loved every minute of. And I'm just so thrilled about being here tonight. I still think I'm a bit of a fraud. I don't think I should deserve it. I think it should be more important people than me to get it. But, uh, yeah, it's a big honour to be here. It's been a great pleasure to get this. And it just shows you how much teamwork was put into it. Practically everyone in the group has contributed towards some sort of fundraising efforts. It's the second year of this event. And I think it's wonderful that so many people here celebrating success in stroke um, and what can be achieved with stroke and all those survivors of stroke. And I would like to say thank you to the Stroke Association for everything they do for us all, professionals and patients alike. We talk about life after stroke. Well, that's what we're celebrating here tonight. But not only do we get inspired and listen to the amazing stories of all our people, but we also have a lot of fun. These are good, fun people. It is a night of great crack and inspiration. What more could you want?